Hello and welcome to the internet. This medium was first conceived of in the early 60s by Robert Kahn and the people at the Defense Advanced Projects Research Agency. It was created as a real operating system in the 1970s and wasn't commercialized till the early 90s. But it was not until today that people like you, Peter and Teddy's mother, came on to the internet. Or as you prefer to think of it, the intercom. Folks say to me, Pete, what can I do with the intercom? Many things today. You can search with the intercom and find anything you're looking for. It's the primary reason you're getting it. I don't know what you're looking for, but you can find it on the intercom. With the intercom today, you can make phone calls. Now, I know, Mom, once you said to me, stop pulling your leg, don't make it up. People don't make phone calls on the Internet, but they do. Anybody you want to talk to is on the Internet. They're there. And it is even true that on the Internet, you can watch television. Now, there are really two fundamental phases to the Internet's history, before you were on it and afterwards. And people say, well, what's the difference? And the answer is pretty simple. Now that you're on the Internet, Teddy and I will be drinking a lot more. <laughs> Welcome to the Intercom. God save these United States, the Intercom, and your family.